Hey, what is up, everybody? Well, this is my review of the Beats by Dr. Dre Studios in white. Before I start this video, I want to just say real quick, I don't have anywhere in my house that has good lighting for videos. I just realized that. Every single freaking room I go into doesn't either, either doesn't have a good spot for the camera or doesn't have a good light. This is the best spot I found, and I'm going to do my review. Alright, so, yes, these are Beats by Dr. Dre. Yes, they are the studios, and they're in white. Alright, so I'm going to do a little re review. First off, I'm going to detach the cable. It seems to be a little bit harder than it should be. Okay. And I'm going to put the headphones aside. Now, this is the thing. Now, this these headphones are made by Monster. So I don't know if you can see very well with my shitty lighting. Probably can't see for shit. But these, this is a really nice cable. Really, 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 really nice cable. Um, it is um, gold plated, or gold tipped. Um, it has 3.5 millimeters. And it is just really nice. Um, that's basically all for that. I just wanted to say, it's really thick. I, could, I don't have um, anything to compare it to. At the moment, but they are, it is really thick. Like, you're not, these don't tangle at all. Um, alright, so moving these aside, I'm gonna explain to you about the headphones. Now, the main thing about these headphones over the Solo HDs is, well, two things. The sound quality on these is far more superior. They sound so much better. I mean, obviously, it must, it's due to the fact that. The drivers are bigger, as you see how big the driver is, and you see how big it goes right over your ear. Um, that's one of the major pluses off the bat. Um, but what, what I want you to notice about them um, is one thing, is they do require batteries. Now the batteries, going right here, you just you got you, you to hold this, and you turn it. Come on, it's actually kind of hard to do, which can be a good thing. And here, pop this off, and you see there's two batteries in there. That's what powers these bad boys. Now, a lot of people are saying, what happens when the battery dies? Well, then you gotta replace them, and you can't use your headphones to replace them. But the reason there's batteries is because they are noise canceling, meaning that these headphones are made to when you turn them on, which there's an on switch. You see, it turns red, turn it off. When you turn them on, you're actually getting sound noise cancellation as soon as you turn them on. Now, these are primarily made out of plastic, but they are really sturdy compared to the Solo HDs. They are a lot stronger feeling. Um, next thing I want to emphasize on these is the... Oh my goodness, you got, I don't know, you can't really see this very well, but this is the nicest feeling pair of headphones I've ever felt and I've tried a lot of freaking headphones in my life um the the these the cushions on these are just incredible the way that this 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 pivots as you can see and it also of course it adjusts right here you can go like this and you can adjust whatever you want here on both sides, whatever you want, you think. The way this can fit to your head makes them feel so beautiful and so comfortable. I've worn them for a good, like, two and a half, three hours at a time without having to take them off, just sitting there jamming out. They sound great. Alright, so the next thing that I just need to emphasize with these headphones, and a lot of things that people are missing with these things, let me just set them down here. Um is pretty much actually let me set them out this way just for a cool look beats alright the thing about these headphones that blows any other headphones out of the water basically and I've tried before I say this I hate the people that are like dude these headphones are overpriced shit and all you're paying for is the look and feel of the look of them and whatever like no no let me tell you 
I've listened. And my dad is an audiophile for the I, I'm I, like he really appreciates good music. Um, in his car, he has a two thousand dollar like upgraded um sound system. What is it? I think it's Harman Kardon in his BMW, and it like he really basically. I'm not trying to brag there. I'm just saying. Bottom line. He enjoys music, and he knows what quality is. He tried in the store, and he's tried mine personally, because I feel like in, in real life, when you actually buy them and you bring them home, they sound better than the store, because the store ones are manipulated too much. These Beats by Dre, Studio Edition, sound better than any, I swear when I tell you this, any headphones displayed in any store you go to that are on display to try. Like, you can go to Best Buy, and they have the Beats by Dre. They have the Soul HDs. They got the Studios. They got the Pros. I honestly think that these sound better than the Pros. They have more... They have heavier bass, but at the same time, their highs and mids are at the same par. So they have more bass than the Pros, in my opinion... Don't don't take my word on it. You try for yourself, but I feel like these are more based due to the fact that the pros, basically their design, they have circular um like cuffs, and they're circular cups, and they're not as comfortable. First of all, and as unless these ones, these ones fit to your um ear and they go ear, they go right inside. Not only are they not as comfortable, um, but the reason that being is when the bass hits on these things it, it, your ear is totally in shape with this with the surface and it really is impeccable how hard the bass hits and that being said not only doesn't they make them more comfortable but the bass feels harder cuz they're more secure to your head in my opinion now you can i in the store i've tried skull candies basically skull candies garbage don't even go for it tried skull candies all right, I've tried Sennheiser. Now Sennheiser is the ones everybody are like, forget about Beats, go with Sennheiser. I've tried 150 to 200, even 250 two fi Oh gosh, I can't talk. 250 dollars Sennheisers, and they don't come close to the sound quality of these. Now I hate the people that say that these headphones are basically overpriced crap. Cause no. No, they are not at all. I mean, here's one good example of it. You see all the famous people. They can afford any headphones they want. All the famous artists and even, like, athletes who use these headphones. And they use the Beats by Dre series. And you see them wearing those. And you, you see that they support those headphones. And then you're going to tell me that they're overpriced crap. Um, yes, they're expensive. But if you want, if you really care for the price then you're going to handle it because they really sound impeccable. I've tried Sony's, Bose, all these different types before buying these. And let me say, not only do these sound better than all of the headphones in the store that I've tried, um, if you're coming like me, like I bought Solo HDs, and I had Solo HDs, and I returned, it, returned them and paid the difference to get these. These sound a lot better than Soul HDs. They're more comfortable. I don't like the fact that the Soul HDs, the cup fits around, um, doesn't fit all the way around your ear. It just hits, sits on top. And um, the one thing that these things got is they have volume. And when I mean volume, I mean... Basically, these things, with my Soul HDs, I'd find, if you could picture an iPod or an iPhone, um, if you picture the volume, when you double-click on the lock screen, how the volume slider, you know, there's, like, play, forward, back. Like, mine would be all the way up to, like, my volume on the Soul HDs. For me to listen to music at a comfortable level of, like, happiness, basically enjoying the big, good bass, punchy bass lines, I'd have to put them all the way to that, um, um, fat, like, forward button on the music. With these... I put these a little bit over halfway, and they almost hurt my ears. They sound so amazing in quality. They sound so good. I can't emphasize it. All right, this video is getting on too long, but Beats by Dr. Dre Studios in white. And I don't even let me get me started on white. They are sexy as shit. Comfortable. In my case, I can afford them. They're comfortable, and the sound quality is superb.
Alright guys, later.